Welcome back. This is the World Cup Daily on City TV. I've got Susu Graham and Daniel Kranting here with me. All right, we'll get into more of uh, the analysis be uh, of that game between Croatia <laughs> and Argentina. But let's do some social media um, uh, stuff. Let's bring you. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Actually, Let, let's bring you out. How are you doing? I'm doing well. Great. Doing what what has uh, the social media world <laughs> been saying following Argentina mm -hmm. um, w uh, beating Croatia yeah. to get to another World Cup final? Yeah, uh, um, social media has been saying a lot um, about Messi, about Croatia's um, failures to deal with um, the threats of Argentina. And before I start, brothers, stay cool, stay cool. You had a very heated debate earlier on, so just stay cool, stay cool. Yeah, the, stay debate cool. is good. Debate it's is good. just, yeah, yeah. It's just they should stay cool. It brings life and energy. But they, to the they should, they should stay cool. Okay. Stay, right. cool. stay cool. cool. This stay is, cool. Stay cool. This is the World Cup. <laughs> and so let's jump on straight into the the Twitter messages <laughs> and at um, Ayagahara. Um, he says, um, 2001 Ronaldinho signs with PSG. Um, 2002 Ronaldinho wins the World Cup. 2017, Mbappe signs with PSG. 2018, Mbappe wins the World Cup. 2021, Messi signs with PSG. 2022, dot, 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 dot. So we wait to see if this, this will also come this. in um, with but Messi winning the World Cup. Let me, let me I have a problem with this. So 2006, what happened? 2010, what happened? 2014, what happened? Why, why aren't they bringing us other? No, he's making reference to... Players signing with PSG. And I'm saying that in 2006, which player signed with PSG for, for in Italy to win the World Cup? No, that's no, why I'm no. this Latin. Zlatan, Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Yeah, but that's his tweet. No, so, 2006, Latin was in there. No, I'm saying when did he sign for PSG? Zlatan. Was it like 2012? Yes. Uh, like, they, they started the project. They didn't even qualify for the 2014 <laughs> World Cup. Uh -huh, so, for you know, because it was two years. That was no, two years. That, was two years. Win the that, that one it was two years. If you had signed in 2013, they would have won two years. But that's Agahara's um, tweet. So, yes, no, I'm let just saying that this destiny is trying to prove. Meditate, no, it's yeah, conspiracy. Yeah. His level of conspiracy, his angle of oh, conspiracy. No, no, no. So, um, but, let's but, jump... But on, me, on a monster, I'm seeing enough how, pointing to this. How, how do people win? even come up with... Anyway, let's move. Okay, so let's jump on to the next one. Uh, at I do know, I do know ball. Um, he tweets, um, Lionel Messi at the age of 35 destroying the best defender of the World Cup so far with such ease surprises me. And yeah, so well, far, value. He said so far, um, I have he's a little bit of an issue with he's it. The best, the best defender. He's, I don't think he's the he, best defender. That's his, uh, well, the but, best defender yeah. of the World Cup so far. So not, far. not he's the best defender at the World Cup. Of the World Cup so far. Yeah, the players who perform. One that's this. He's caught the eye. You agree with him? Oh, I've not said anything. I'm just saying, I'm explaining what he said. Oh, but I'm just, so do you agree with him? I don't want to give an opinion. Okay, then let's move on to the <laughs> next one. Um, so, uh, at Ian Smith the third, he says, Messi just reduced... Um, but the Vardial's transfer by half. Um, yeah, because of that insane skill that he pulled off on Vardial. I honestly believe it was a welcome to international football moment where uh, Messi just delivered to Vardial because he's a youngster in there. And at Ian Smith, the third, he comes back again. He says, Messi even has Brazilians hoping he wins the World Cup. <laughs> so uh, basically telling the world that Messi is loved by all and a lot of people. And so let's move on to the next one. But hold on, hold on. Which, hold on. which Brazilian... They say Rivaldo. Rivaldo. Yes. Yeah. Rivaldo. Rivaldo. Ah, Rivaldo. Yeah, because he, he, I, he, he believes in idealistic football, football in his purest sense. Okay, so you, you, you read what has a Brazilian hoping he wins because I've not heard. Okay, so one. this is the <laughs> tweet <laughs> from <laughs> Rivaldo. So what did Rivaldo So Rivaldo say? said, we no longer it's have like Brazil Instagram or Neymar. Instagram, Instagram caption. Oh, Instagram, Instagram caption, Instagram yeah. Caption. So we no longer have Brazil or Neymar Jr. in this cup final. So I'm going with Argentina. No worse for. For you, Lionel Messi, you deserve to be the you deserve to be world champion before. But God knows all things and will crown you this Sunday. You deserve this title for the person you are and for the wonderful football you have always played. Hats off to you. God bless you. So that's and, and that, so that's that, the Instagram that message came from, Rivaldo. from Rivaldo. Yes. Anyway, that the, and the, the guy just lines. made a reference that Messi even has uh, Brazilians. That, that'd be the agenda. Yeah, so, yes, it's the Barcelona line. Anyway, I'm, that's fine. Ronaldinho was at the game, yes. Yeah. Ronaldinho was there. Yeah, Ronaldinho was there. That's, yes. that's fine, it's okay. That's fine. Maybe, yeah, uh, Barcelona yeah. alliance. Yeah, yeah yes, Barcelona yes. kind of connection in there. And so that's um, a tweet from Ian Smith the third, and he quoted mm -hmm. um, cool. Rivaldo's Instagram message. And so let's move on to the next one. Um, at God underscore day underscore, he says, we don't wake our enemies. We, we, 
we don't wake. Our enemies won't sleep. Good morning, Messi FC. Mm -hmm. And so, yeah, clearly he's, he's a big fan of Lionel Messi. And he's giving mm -hmm. a big shout to the big man himself um, who orchestrated Argentina's win over Croatia last night. At Bastens Weinsteiger, he tweets, just watch another Messi show tonight. What a performance. Congrats, Argentina. Let's see who will win, who will complete the final on Sunday. So, Bayern Munich legend, uh, Bastens Weinsteiger, um, you should go and make sure out. Germany doesn't go out in the next round. And stop taking <laughs> selfies outside the stadium. Your country is suffering. You are there watching somebody else. Oh, but oh, but Schweinsteiger has yeah. the right to be watching the World Cup. Oh. Germany is a world powerhouse. Yes. When you are disgraced like this, your legend should be hey. taking no, selfies I, I, outside the stadium. World you. football is Brazil and Germany. Ah, seriously. Everybody understands. I'm sure after this, you have a few things to share with the DMV. You should go now. They are in a meeting. <laughs> <laughs> but like uh, Rivaldo said, me, uh, Brazil is out, Neymar is out. So he's shouting out Lionel Messi. Germany is out. Brazil he's shouting out, out Lionel Messi. The second success time you have been knocked out in the group stages, but you are smiling in front of the stage. But, he, but, but he's, he's the one-top winner. He's the one-top winner. 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 But, but DK, is he on the coaching <laughs> staff? Let me, let me ask you. <laughs> but but, <laughs> but DK, is he on the oh, coaching relax, staff? relax, relax, Daniel. relax. Oh, calm down. Yeah. Yeah. You're making the viewers see me some way. Let me land. Okay, make it. Let me land. If uh, Ghana <laughs> went to an AFCON, mm -hmm. got kicked out in the group stages, 2019, mm -hmm. let's say that happened. Yeah. 2021, it happened again. Yes. And then in the semi-final between Nigeria and uh, 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 Morocco, Maglese is just smiling he, outside the stadium, fact, you saying that congratulations to Nigeria. Will you be happy? No, DK, let me even give you a more relevant example. Our good friend Yao Minta says George Barton shouldn't go and do being sports. He said he shouldn't go and do <laughs> being sports. <laughs> being sports, <laughs> being sports. But, <laughs> but he is heavily involved in our technical team. This uh, Baston Schweinsteiger doesn't play any role in the German football team. He does. Okay. You let's he move on. He doesn't play. Let's move on. Let's, let's move on. Let's move on. Let's move on. Um, so yeah, let's, let's, let's have the next one. Yes. At RD, and at RD scouting uh, tweet, <laughs> that game reminded me of the old Messi we all fell in love with. Yes, okay. indeed. Looking at how he juke past um, Vadio. Yes, it was a throwback to 2007, 2008, yeah. 2009. Yeah, just, just, just to pause. What old Messi? We see this thing every day. Don't do like. No, it's true. Right, I'm not cut. So oh, you be calm be down. Oh. Like, calm down. You see, <laughs> if Ronaldo do step overs or something and he went by, you can see the old one because we see a who a who <laughs> Messi against Australia. Didn't we see him turning them inside out? Ah, if this guy is forty, he will still be turning people who think they can defend against him. What is old oh, Messi? At forty, dear. So, ah, do you think at thirty-five he will be turning this twenty-year-old boy like this? <laughs> oh, he's not to be the boy's father. Oh. <laughs> Ashok. Okay, okay let's now move let's move on to, <laughs> to the next slide. At, <laughs> at Bish on the Rocks um, tweets, just can't stop thinking about Messi's assist. A marvelous mischief. Yes. Um, so we, we, uh, people are, are romanticizing about you know, Messi's dance around um, Vadio and uh -huh. assisting um, Julian Alvarez for um, his second, his brace against Croatia. Now moving on to the next slide, and at Lisi Priyak, um, tweet, when he was 10 years old, he asked Messi for a selfie. Today, Julian Alvarez, who is, who is 22 years of, um, of age, scored two goals for Argentina against Croatia from the Messi assist. And Messi scored a goal on, an, on a penalty he, when he got fouled and now enters the final. What an inspiration. And so that's a little bit of a, a time lapse in there where they jump back into the time machine. And... Um, highlights the progress of Julian Alvarez. Before we um, move to on, I just want to give a, a, a small start. The last 22 year old to score four World Cup goals for Argentina was Gonzalo Higuain. So shout out to Higuain because he, oh, wow. he was a trendsetter before he was scored. So he scored four at the World Cup? Yes, the oh, yeah. World Cup. For, I, I honestly believe Higuain doesn't get a lot of his flowers because. Because of, of people like you. No, no, not because of a lot of people like no, it's me. True. No, it's not because it's of a lot true. of people. No, you, okay. You, you no, ended your statement. I didn't end statement. my statement. So let me, let me, let me. Let me, let me oh, yeah, 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 I'm giving okay. an allegation. But okay. I didn't. People like you. I didn't uh -huh. finish my statement. Relax. Okay. He doesn't get a lot of. Plaudits. because of people like you. Why do you? Because you people are the ones who blame Higuain for the 2010 uh, knockout, for the 2014 uh, final, uh -huh. blaming everything on him. And 15 too, the Copa America and final. And the Copa America final. But you don't blame Messi for the penalty miss in 2016. You don't blame Messi for missing the one-on-one. -on -one. It was the 75th minute against Noya. The same goal baby just scored, Messi could not score. Baby. I'm the same goal, maybe just believable. called Messi Green score. Okay, you it's mean. not fair. Okay. I'm saying that it's a team effort. Mm -hmm. If you fail, you fail together. 
If you win, you, you win. win together. Don't win. This is why when you win, then you give it to one person. When they fail, then they identify somebody, it is this person's fault. And then you finish and come back to seven years later and come and tell me that he got in, doesn't, he doesn't get the applause that he gets. You were part of the people. Uh, well, okay, I'm let's. Part, well, on. I'm not part of it. All okay, I'm saying is that uh, Higuain's best performances are a little bit mistimed. In the lead up to the final, he will score the goals for you. When he gets to the final, final, the crunch moment, then he starts missing but chances. Somebody that, else should help him. That's unfair. That's Relax. unfair. Relax. 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 Relax starts missing chances then they miss out on the champions league okay the, you, you, you get that's that's, that's, why, that's why i believe higuain doesn't get a lot of his goals uh, exactly so uh, blasting it over there by he should have scored his penalty like by now he's going to have an international trophy why did you do help 